What's up, guys? This is Fonz Really Fellhand, and today we have the winner of the previous day's contest of three days of premium time giveaway, and that is Brogue One. I've sent him a message on Xbox Live, so just look out for that, my friend. You have a code coming to you, and the party doesn't stop there, guys. We have loads of codes. I totally forgot I had like 35 codes to give out and they're not all three days of premium some of them are I think seven days plus a garage slot or something like that I don't know I'd have to look but you know what we'll get to that later so moving on let's get to the game also guys I just want to mention I saw a lot of really good ideas um, speaking having Klingon subtitles in a video I think that is freaking hilarious I wouldn't know what to put, but I would make it up, and then you guys would be like, yeah, that sounds good. Another good thing, uh, or bad thing, uh, Tiger P. I may run it, I may not. I'm not really a heavy guy. I'm not. I just, I don't enjoy a tank where you are supposed to get shot. That just seems a little counterproductive. Uh, also, somebody wanted me to run Chinese TD land. Ugh, I, I would, mmm. I, I may rather sign up for voluntary castration. I am not a tank destroyer type of guy. I, I don't know. You know what? But I may do it. I may surprise you and myself, and I may say, hey, let's go out here and do this. I don't even know when it comes out. I suppose I probably should. It may be out already. I don't know. Moving on. Let's get to the game. So, here we are, Bat Chat. little solo dolo action here. You know, we're by ourselves, uh, and you know, if you're by yourself, guys, you want to be very, very cautious. You don't want to do a lot of the brash stuff you're going to see when we're in a larger platoon. So, you know, we're going to take some, some very non-risky shots. We're going to kind of uh, long scope here for a little bit, for at least the intro, uh, you know, to kind of see what's going on. We don't necessarily want to put ourselves in harm's way we want to retain our HP and you know sometimes you know you see me go out there guys and I just get beat up right off the game and then I have to manage you know the rest of the game for 600 HP <laughs> don't don't do that you know keep as much of your HP as possible uh, even if it means you know not necessarily being on the front line which is a medium driver you should not be on the front line. This is kind of my argument with, say, tanks like the E-50. I have no idea what's going on right there. I'm... Okay, guys, we're going to skip this part. I don't know if I had some issues with my capture card. But you know what? We're not that much further into the game. We've got an additional couple of pins here, and we're on a reload. So, yeah, I don't know how that one kind of snuck in there and it just randomly screwed up in the middle of the game I don't know that's weird man maybe I maybe I bumped it or passed gas or I, I don't know something weird was happening uh, right here guys you know we've got a thin skin target and we're just we're just rolling on him you know he's got no armor we were going straight ahead it'd be different if I was turning left to right then you would kind of see some aiming and whatnot going on uh, in theory uh, I, fellas, I do not know what is going on right here. The capture card just has a seizure every now and again. I don't know. I, I don't know what's wrong. But it's fine. We're going to get through it. We're going to get through it together. Moving on. Uh, we're on another reload here. We just went on a little mini rampage and just tried to clean up a little bit around the edges there. Got rid of the, uh, gentleman in the heavy tank there. Removed a little bit of a uh, little bit of resistance over there. Now we're kind of sweeping around their other flank. Uh, so as you can see, we've kind of got them boxed in, uh, you know, for all intents and purposes. Granted, it looks like we didn't have a strong presence go our left flank. We're going to see if we can't possibly put some rounds on this IS-3 right here. This is kind of the play you want to go for if he is pointed this way towards you uh, because it's no longer a pike nose. It's kind of angled. Uh, and a little known fact, yes, the, the front of the IS-3 and your 7 and your 8 or the T-10, whatever they call it now, is known as a pike nose. I said that the other day to somebody and they literally had no idea what I was saying. So yes, that is called a pike nose because it is pointy. Yeah, so little known fact. Okay, so we just ended that hundo. 
uh, and we just ended the IS-3 with the pike nose. So now we're on another reload. Uh, the capture card looks like it's still stuttering, so you know, expect to see that for the rest of the game, sadly. I have no idea what's wrong, but it's fine. Moving on. Uh, we can kind of see a little crack of daylight here at this fatherland. Uh, we've got some, some kind of good shots right there. Just, you know, we're waiting on the gun, and that's fine. No problem waiting on the gun. Everybody has to wait on something. We're going to wait on the murder. Uh, so now we're just going to kind of go through here and just kind of mop up. That's the general consensus here. We've got a gentleman right here. Uh, we're going to scope a good round here, put that in him. Uh, I'm taking rounds uh, in the tank in with the capture card as well. Uh, it's just all jankity. Uh, we're going to see if we can't make a last run on these guys over here. Uh, let's see if we can't. It looks like this gentleman is reverse side scraping. I think that's what he's doing. Uh, and I'm a fan of that, you know, uh, you want to end up reverse side scraping for a lot of tanks. Uh, no, he is, I think he's, I, you know, I honestly have no idea. I don't know whether he is or not. Uh, what I was going to say, guys, a lot of time with a pike nose, you're going to see them reverse side scrape. So that's something that, you know, you need to keep in mind. Um, also, guys, going forward, I think I'm going to do a giveaway about every one, two weeks. So yeah, just make sure to look out for that. I will make it very obvious by saying giveaways and stuff. Oh, they got me. I was trying to escape. I was trying to turn and they got me. I think I'm going to do it about every one or two weeks. So make sure to look out for that. Uh, also, we're going to try to get the Defender Weak Spot Guide done at some point this week. Uh, as, as well as Interview with the Tankers, probably going to be a few weeks out as I'm going to kind of be occupied next weekend. Uh, so, yeah, it's we've got a lot of things coming here, and I'm really going to actively try to work on the Chinese tank line and the Tiger P, even though it's going to be under duress. So anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoy. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. We'll see you next time.